What's up guys, I'm Jamal and I'm back with another video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about what it's like to live in Jacksonville, Florida. I'll be answering some of your questions from my previous video, so if you haven't seen that one yet, I'll put the link in the description below. If you find this video to be helpful, make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And let's get into the video. Okay, so one of the questions I thought was pretty interesting from that video is from Nikki Fred. She said, how is the diversity? I live in South Florida now and we're thinking of moving to Jacksonville. I just want to know if I'll fit in there. Coming from down south, there's so much diversity. It's crazy. Would hate to move there and not love it. Okay, Nikki. Um, diversity. So Jacksonville is a really big city. So there's a lot of different people in Jacksonville. Um, I mean, as far as fitting in goes, I mean, if you're an outgoing person, nice, open-minded, like, you're gonna fit right in. It's all about who you are and, like, how you see the world. If you're a person that's very, like, narrow-minded and you only see life one way, then, like, I don't know, maybe you won't fit in. I, I'm the type of person where, like, I tend to be, I can mingle with really any crowd. I tend, to, I like meeting new people, I like learning different ways of life, so it was fun for me living in Jacksonville. I made a lot of my friends from going out to the bars a lot, so I don't know if you're into that or not, but that was like a great place for me to mingle and get to know the people of the area and the culture. Hope that answers your question. Okay, so another interesting question that I saw was from Melody Creates Music. She said, I've been thinking about moving my family down there, saw statistics about it being dangerous and it made me a little nervous. I did visit there a few years ago though. It didn't seem as dangerous as where I was coming from. Okay, yeah. Before I moved there, I also heard those same rumors that it was extremely dangerous, lots of crime, but I'm also from New York where people also say the same thing about New York. And really, nowadays, I feel like everywhere in the world there's gonna be some type of crime. It wasn't a place where you felt like you can't even leave your house. I mean, it's not as dangerous as you as your mind lets you take it or imagine it. Um, I, I mean, I went to the beach a lot alone by myself. Like, I mean, I've, you know, gone out at night to the bars and like, I don't know, it's not, it's not dangerous. It's not a dangerous area. Like, oh, that's the thunder. To answer your question, it's not dangerous. Don't be scared. Don't, no, it's not dangerous. You'll be fine. Okay, so this comment kind of piggybacks off of the last one. It's from Mick Tyree Girls. She said, um, I'm born and raised right here in Jacksonville, Florida. And it sounds like you were on the nice area nice side area try coming to the west side of jacksonville florida okay so she could be right maybe on the west side it's a different culture i have no idea i didn't live on the west side yeah but um thanks mctai shout out to you okay so brent t says keep more coming you're doing good thank you how is the job market there have not been there for two years. The job market wasn't too bad. I got a, I got more of a stable job around like three months of me being there. Um, it was super stressful, obviously. Anytime you move somewhere and you gotta like find a job right away, it's all, it's always super stressful because you know you can't really look before you go because you, they kind of want you in that state when they hire you. So, um, but no, it didn't take long. I mean, you you definitely find your way. Okay, Taylor Made Man said, compared to New York, Jacksonville is peaceful. Were you surprised about the Southern hospitality? New York is standoffish with a bunch of toll roads. Um, hmm. Yes, New York can be a bit standoffish. Was I surprised about the Southern hospitality down there? No, not really. I mean, I didn't really go. I'm an I'm a very open-minded type of person. So when I moved there, I was I just moved there, just like ready to just let Florida accept me or whatever. And I felt like it was. I felt like everybody was super friendly. Like I'm a super friendly person. So usually when I like speak to people, they're nice to me. I. I I never had a situation where like I felt like, oh, what a fucking asshole or like, like I never, never happened to me. So yeah, I love the culture. I love the, I love the food. Um, but I'm also from New York where it's like lots of different types of food here too. So the only really change I felt like I experienced was beach and weather. And honestly, like 
it was a dream come true. I, I just, yeah. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any more questions, make sure to drop them down below and maybe I'll make another video about other types of details about it. Um, just let me know. I don't know how much you guys care about videos like this, but thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.